This is Nothing OS 4.0 and so all the gallery features, AI updates that they promised, they are all missing. So in nothing style, did they lie? But before that, three features that will blow your mind. First, there's some visual changes. The setting menu looks different. There's extra dark mode, which is truly dark. Darker than your excess heart. And finally, there's dual pop-up windows, YouTube here, WhatsApp here, Instagram in the background. Good for multitasking. You can swipe up to minimize, pull down to expand. The second feature here is AI dashboard. Every Android has AI now. So Nothing OS 4 shows you exactly when any AI or large language model is active. See, I'll use up the essential key to save some info. On the top right corner, you'll see a yellow mark indicating some AI task is going on in the background. If you tap on it, it shows what AI models are running in background. Now the third mind-blowing feature is Nothing Playground. And this is crazy. You can literally create apps just by typing. So I go to Nothing Playground and I just type what I want, like a fashion composer. AI generates it in 5 seconds. No coding, no play store. Now this feature is currently in the waitlist. You can download widgets made by other users. There's camera presets, glyph toys, music EQ profiles. It's like a community app store. Now phone 3 gets 6 widgets whereas other phones as of now have only 2 widgets. Now the Nothing OS 4 open beta is live for these phones. Now a lot of features promised are not here and smartphone companies are getting in the habit of announcing features and then delivering it after 1 year. Or just not delivering it. Anyways, this playground feature seems a step in the right direction and different from other companies. Share this with iPhone users who get sticker creation as an AI feature. Oh, sorry, Apple intelligence. Subscribe to TechWiser for faster Android updates.